Hello folks, this is a 2014 October November paper 13 and the question number is 27. It says that the variation with the distance x of the intensity i along a stationary stationary sound wave in air is shown as in the following graph. So what you can see the trend is at a distance x equal to 0, the intensity is maximum. At 5 cm it's a minimum. At 10 cm it's again maximum and at 15 cm it's again minimum. So the pattern just follows. The speed of sound in air is 340 meters per second as given here. What's the frequency of the sound wave? So now here the graph is uh, of intensity versus the distance x. So let's uh, uh, let's uh, take a wave here. Take a wave. Let us take a wave here. So in any progressive wave, uh, if I take a progressive wave like this, somewhat like this wave, uh, and if I go for its uh, intensity here in the next graph, next graph, and if I draw timelines like this, so this is the timeline. Uh, another timeline here, another timeline here, and here the timeline for the uh, maximum amplitude, timeline for the maximum negative amplitude, again timeline for the maximum amplitude like this. So this is for uh, for the uh, dis displace, uh, displacement here. This is the displacement according to distance, distance, and this is the I want to draw the graph for intensity against dist distance and it is the intensity. So what I can say is uh, when it is zero, uh, the intensity is zero of course, here zero again zero, zero, zero and zero, zero. So at a zero displacement the intensity is zero. At max displacement the intensity is maximum. So it is somewhat like this. And at a zero uh, and at maximum negative displacement it's again maximum and positive it's because it's because the intensity is uh, proportional to displacement displacement square so here minimum and here also maximum so now the graph will be somewhat like this from here it goes like this then it comes like this again it goes like this it comes like this again it goes like this and again comes like this and so on so the shape may not be uh, the perfect one but still the pattern is like this now uh, if a stationary wave is formed what happens here is the stationary wave is somewhat like this. Uh, it can become like this, like this, like this, like this, and so on. So here, lambda means the distance from here to here. Lambda means the distance from here to here. So that means from here to here it is lambda. Lambda. So let me write it here as this as lambda. That means the distance from here to here is lambda by 2. So from to here to here it is lambda by 2 for the intensity. Now let's come back to this graph. So the distance from this zero point to this zero point, this thing is equal to lambda by two here. Or I can say the distance from here to here also, it's lambda by two. So that means lambda by two is equal to 15 minus five is, it is 10 uh, centimeter. Uh, or lambda is equal to two into 10 equal to 20 centimeter. So this is equal to 0 0.20 meters 0 0.20 uh, meters 20 centimeter means so from here what I can now do is so we have got uh, let me do the calculations here frequency equal to velocity by lambda so equal to velocity is 340 meter per second and this lambda is 0 0.20 so if I just divide it it becomes uh, 217 so it is 1700 100 hertz so the frequency of the wave being produced is 700 hertz and the answer is given by given by given by given by choice number a here so choice number a should be the correct answer